Welcome to the 2016 presidential debates. I'm your host, Cakes1001, and tonight we will see a cat fight. Recently, there was a very controversial switch on um, dry food brands. Maya, what are your thoughts? I'm not so much concerned about the dry food, but the lack of wet food. Bye. Maya, we don't give you more wet food because it makes you poop too much. Um, anyways, Oscar, your thoughts? Okay, so next question been a hot debate on insects in the home, more specifically with moths. Oscar, I'll let you take this one. If I were president, I would have a moth, at least 12 moths, in every room of the house. I believe that all moths should have equal rights and be allowed in the house whenever they want. Mm. So you're saying that you want equal rights for moths? Well, uh want equal rights for those moths. You just want to take their wings off so they can walk around with like little weird moth bodies. Mm, no comment. Anyways, moving on. Uh, relating to the last question on moths, what are your thoughts on birds? Uh, yes. I've always said, less birds outside, more birds inside. Um, this looks like it's gonna be the last question. If you were to become president of the United States, what would your plan for the future look like? If I was president, more wet food, more birds, more moths, no bats. Well, if I was president, um, I would probably not change much. I'm pretty happy as it is. Bye. And that concludes our debate for tonight. Now that the debate is over, the next part is up to you. We need your votes to determine who will be the next president of the United States of America. All you have to do to vote is snap us either Oscar's name or Maya's name, and we will tally up the votes. Your vote really does matter. This is important. Cats. Signing out, your host, Cakes One Doe, and make sure to add me on Snapchat for more cat-related stuff. And have a good night or afternoon, whatever, bye. as the president of the United States. Here you go. Oh, my. You can also have one. Here you go. Okay, your thoughts, your policies, and your overall cuteness will help you become a great leader. There you go.